No. I asked if I can be heard, only to look down and see that my mic was still muted. I'm so smart. It's okay. Things happen. Okay, but things can be heard. I can be heard. Sound all good. Everything, everything, everything. Should be good. You guys will let me know if something's wrong, I'm sure. So, it is Friday, and here we are, once again, playing KOTOR. Uh, so last where we left off... That's a good question. Where did we leave off? Oh, okay, so, um... Silly me! So I went back into those ruins to talk to, like, an ancient droid and everything to try to make sure I didn't miss anything that was part of the main story in terms of, uh, learning about the Starforge. And, um, the fun fact was that despite me going through everything the first time around, it wasn't until the second time where I realized I missed a door that actually contained like, further clues to the Star Forge, <laughs> uh, to basically keep going and, and leave Dantooine. So, uh, the short story is that we discovered more about the Star Forge and found clues on, about it on other planets, planets, jeez, such as, uh, Korriban and others, uh, Tatooine even. And so, we are here, having just arrived on Korriban. And, uh, we're gonna see how this goes. This should be fun, right? So, yeah. Um, yeah, I literally, like, just walked in, so I'm assuming I'm about to find out more of what I need to do, uh, as I keep going. So, let's just kind of waltz right in, and here we go. But, happy Friday, everyone! I hope everyone is doing well, and, uh, is excited for the weekend, and hopefully some good weather. We had a terrible windstorm last night. It was bad. I should probably talk to this guy. But yeah, happy Friday! Greetings! Welcome to Korriban. If there's anything you need, you can talk to me. Sweet! What do I do? Ooh, merchandise. Uh, no, not right now. Well, let's take a look. I don't think I have that many credits on here, though, and I believe in the last session I made sure I was as geared up as possible. Weapons mostly. I've got connections. You'll need them if you're going to be spending any time here. That's fun. Let me see your weapons. Uh, okay, I got 3,000-ish credits, so that's not... Terrible. I feel like I should have more. <laughs> but, oh well. <laughs> we'll see what happens. <clears throat> I'm not seeing too, too much. Okay, that's fine. We're fine. Actually, what does my journal say? Bastila, Karth, Candor, Quest for the Starforge. Be -be 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 Okay, yeah, so I think I just needed to look here, my dear friend. Discover what I'm we doing! Have a group of newcomers to our little colony. I don't believe I've seen any of them before, have you? Great. Just what we needed. Some punks to come steal our lunch credits. <laughs> Smart mouthed newcomers to boot. Looks pretty fresh to me, Lashon. That's what I thought. Well, stranger, I don't know whether you're aware of this or not, but here on Korriban, the Sith do as they please. And we are Sith. Quite literally, oh. whether you live or die depends upon our whim. What do you think of that? Mm -hmm. Let's see, I don't think there's any need for hostilities. You can try to kill me, you'd fail, but you can try. <laughs> I think that's a lot of responsibility for simple scum like you. Ooh! Which one do I do? Two or three. Mm -hmm. We'll do number three, because that sounds smart-ass-like. How precocious. More I think precocious. this one tried to make a joke, don't you? I didn't think it was funny. Neither did I. A brave face, perhaps, but I'm more interested in being amused at the moment, I think. What do you say? Amuse us, make us laugh, and we might just consider allowing you to live. <sighs> you might be heading for more trouble than you can handle. If you really want to fight, just make the first move. It'll be your last. Er, okay, these two Mandalorians are out in the woods. Ha <laughs> uh, please don't hear me, I don't want to fight. <clears throat> yeah, let's do the joke. That sounds fun. Go on. Oh, fudge. One of them collapses. 
He doesn't seem to be breathing, and his eyes are glazed. The Under Mandalorian takes out his communicator and contacts his commander. I've heard this one before. I think... Quiet! Oh my gosh, she's really... <laughs> Did I persuade her? He gasps. <gasps> my partner has collapsed! I don't know what to do! After a moment, the commander responds. Calm down, I can help. And then... First, let's make sure your partner is dead. <laughs> what? <laughs> there is a silence. Then, a blaster shot is heard. Back on the communicator, the Mandalorian says, Alright, now what? Cute. Maybe you should try juggling next time. <laughs> That's the oldest <laughs> oh, it joke failed. In the book. Well, it certainly didn't amuse us, did it? Try again. Uh, be careful, you might be heading for more trouble. Oh, okay, so I'm back to the original I tried. I'm not looking for trouble, but I'm not here to amuse you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess I'll do the second one. I don't want that much attention on me, even though I have no problem picking a fight. So we'll do Oh, two. I see. Well, we'll just have to see about that, Although won't we? Although this is going to be a fight, I'm pretty sure, anyways. <laughs> it looks like this one's not afraid of you at all, Lasho. Are you going to let us be insulted? Oh, get over yourself already. I'm tired of this. Yeah, this one's got some backbone at least. Let's go. Fine. I'll deal with you later. Oh! They didn't want to fight me. Well then. You joiks. Alright. That was fun. What do we got here? Who's this? Don't go near that Sith place. They won't let you in. And then Sith will probably shoot you before they look at you. Mm. I can't wait to get back to the core systems. This planet is dangerous with all those Sith wandering around. That's mission, and I've got Karth with me. Right, because I told Bastila to stay on the ship. What's in here? Oh boy. Here we go. What's up? Huh? Oh, sorry. I was thinking about Terrace. I still can't believe it's gone. I mean, I grew up there, and now it's... It's just gone. Right. I haven't talked to you since I recruited you, so I'm sure I've got some uh, companion backstory to go through. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. I don't really think there's anything you can say. I just have to find some way to deal with it, I guess. It'll take some time. Look, I'm not saying I can't go on or anything hey, like that. Hey, thanks it's for just... the host. It's a shock, you know? I mean, I knew the Sith were evil and all, but the reality of it kind of slaps you in the face. But yeah, I suppose that's why we need to stop Malak, right? The more time I spend dwelling on Terrace, the more chance some other planet will get wiped out. I guess that's what it comes down to. So Sith don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll be okay. And if you need my help against Malak or the Sith, I'll be there for you. Yeah, at all terrible. What's going on here? Something you need? Oh, I can talk to you. Who are you? Nobody you need to know. I'm just here to try to get into the Sith Academy. Why? Why would you want to get into the Why? Academy? Why? That's really a dumb question. To become a Sith, of course. To wield the greatest power in the galaxy. Mm, well. What do you think I don't know. Are? I've been here for a few days now, and the Sith okay. still haven't paid me any attention. I suppose I That's should consider myself sign. lucky. I've heard of some of the prospects getting killed. Still, it's all a test, and I'll just have to be strong. Uh, how does someone get into the well, academy? Well, you have to impress one of the Sith. The final decision rests with Uthura Ban, however. She's the one who decides exactly which of us get into the academy or not. I've been hanging out hoping she'll come by and notice me, to be honest. Usually she? she's in the academy, but sometimes she comes out into the colony to look for prospects. If she's in the colony, she can usually be found in the cantina, but not always. She's one of the most powerful Sith in the academy, I hear. Mm, why not join the Jedi? <laughs> I don't feel like asking that, yeah, but fine. Yeah, go on. Journal entry added. Yay! What'd I get? Enter the Sith Academy. I had a feeling I had to do that. By the way, hi Paul! <laughs> Hope you're doing well and happy Friday! Uh, in order to get inside, Sith are good peeps. <laughs> Uh, be approved of and be noted as worthy. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, she can reportedly be sometime- oh, in the cantina. Check the cantina. Yeah, that's what I thought. I just wanted to double check. 
This is not the cantina, is it? Well, I guess it's a good thing I talked to that random citizen. Oh, no, mission Y. Mission Y. Mission Y. Karth, why? Uh, people, I can't go through them in this game. One of Korriban's primary trade routes went through Terrace. Now that it's destroyed, Your the colony here will have an even harder dead. time of it. I saw photos of it! I cannot wait! It looks so cool! I've had two friends killed by the Sith already. It must be some kind of test. So how long has it I'll taken survive. so far? I'll make it into the Academy. This is the 16 hour it. one, right? I talk to you next? One of Korriban's primary trade routes went through Terrace. Now that it's destroyed, the colony here will have an even harder time of it. That is so... man. I suppose you've heard about the destruction of Taurus, yes? That's so Awful long. business, that. Zerka lost a fortune there. Not that the Sith care. Um, what does the Zerka do here on Korriban? We do some mining here, and are responsible for local shipping and support of the Sith on Korriban. Hi, Matt! Our starboard is mostly yes, just I'm freighters and Yes, I'm on I love but Dantooine! But we do get many Yay. travelers that come here to learn from the Sith. This office is actually our administrative headquarters for this region. Rather Happy Friday, Matt! isn't it? We offer Hope good prices well. here to those traders that keep the colony supplied. If you're in need of anything, this is the place to come. What you got to offer? You certainly can. Allow me to punch up our stock. Sweet. Life support packs. Those sound important and needed for someone like me. <laughs> um, Beholder was head was actually 18 hours. I slowed it a bit at the end to make sure the details were good. Do you, do you have to, like, man it the whole time? Or are you just capable of, like, letting it do its thing and then just check on it every once in a while? Ooh, I probably need these med packs. Oh, armor that I haven't seen that I can't afford. Mm, I can afford that one. Uh, all I can change once is going is speed and temp. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm glad you're doing well, Matt. He has to behold it. <laughs> I can't afford, like, any of this stuff. Is that 2,000? I can get this. Oh, but that's heavy armor. All right, well, I'll probably check it out after I, f oh. Stealth skills, that's probably helpful. Sith regenerator. I'm gonna buy med packs, cause I probably need those, buy. Two, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's take some advanced ones, because I'm going to need those. How many should I... Can I buy all of them? Two. That should be good enough. I got ten in ten. <laughs> I'll be alright. What's this construction kit? Oh, for a droid to repair itself. Oh, that's fun. And what's this? Uh, a life support pack contains thermal regenerators and other equipment for the treatment of wounds. They cannot be used by droids. Life support packs heal 30 vitality points plus your wisdom mod plus three times. Oh, those sound important. One, two, three, four, five. Now I definitely don't have any money, but this is probably important. <laughs> All right, let's save that since I did some things. Uh, blur, blur, blur. This is the game. So yeah, I still have, I think I said it before, this is still the save progress that I have right before killing Juhani, so I can always go back and do her little thing as a side thing. Not making it canon, because obviously I have this current save, and I did actually start, um, like, another little personal playthrough. <laughs> <laughs> just to like I haven't gotten past this playthrough so this is still my playthrough but I did the personal one to kind of make sure the the story is being like solidified in my head and I'm learning all of the lore and whatnot um, so it's actually pretty interesting and it's a well, lot this is easier a Sith of course going this the second the law time. Here. I'm here only to protect Zerka's interest so um, that playthrough I just arrived on Dantooine because I'm keeping it like one chapter or one planet apart and, uh, who knows? Maybe I won't kill jo Juhani that time. Uh, so... I'm assuming... Yeah, I keep going this way. No, I slept while it worked. J 
just have a progress bar. It doesn't even have a time left given. If it's anything like a Microsoft progress bar, it's just there for looks. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. Well, that person just left. Wait, I was going to talk to you. I can't wait to get oh, back to the core systems. Oh, I must have talked to you already. Dangerous Someone already said that. Warning. Who's this dude? You're the one flying the Ebonhawk now. I saw you disembarking earlier. Maybe? Uh, who wants to know? Names and lures? Not that it's important. I don't know you and you don't know me. What's important is that we've been waiting for the shipment for a month now. Look, kind of shipment. I suppose we should be grateful that the shipment survived. Don't tear us at all, though, right? Anyway, hand it over and let's finish this. Do this. <laughs> Um... Yeah, what are you talking about? You don't work for Davik? Just how is it that you happen to be flying the Ebonhawk? I'm about to get in trouble, aren't I? Uh -oh. Um... What? I'm going to go with the second option. I don't I don't need it to be flat out known uh, that I stole the Evan Hawk. I don't know. I mean, it's probably, the word's probably going to get out anyways, but I don't need to, like, help announcing it, I guess. So I'll do option number two. Hey, Marv! Um, I just arrived on Korriban, so I just got the quest. Uh, to, um, for the mission, I should say. I just got the mission to uh, try to enter the Sith Academy. So I'm slowly making my way to the cantina because we're going to be here for weeks. Why do you say that? <laughs> we arranged for some... Wait, I missed it. What did he want? What was the shipment? Did I see spice? You spice? I suspect if it is, it would have been in the container we gave him locked and requiring a code. Might have you seen such a thing? I don't know if I even have! Hi, Liz! Just a hunch. It's unsettling your clipping into the camera? What does that mean? <laughs> Um, I may have? How much is it worth to you? 1,000 Oh, I see what you mean. I thought you meant me specifically, and I was like, what am I doing? <laughs> uh, holy crap. I'll take a look into it, because I like credits. Set the code on the container to Red 47. When you get the spice, bring it to me here. I'll wait for you. I legit don't know or remember if I've run into this kind of shipment or not. Finally, an easy DC. Roll some five. <laughs> Still failed. <laughs> nice job. Aw, Matt is now a cat. All right, let's, so let's check this out here. What, here we go, unfinished business. You have encountered an alien by the name of Lurs who mentions that there's a container on board the Ebonhawk filled with spice that Davik had agreed to bring him. You have agreed to return to Lurs with the spice and he provided you with the code RED47. What if, <laughs> funny thing, just, what if that was the stuff that uh, the little girl that I talked to last stream got through? What if she just took all the spice? <laughs> That'd be pretty funny, actually. Perspective Sith. I've had two friends killed by the Sith already. Yeah. It must be what do you want? What do you want? What do you want? Who are you? I'm trying to get into the Sith Academy. Around here, they call us hopefuls. That's nice. Whoa, mission! Did you see, guys, see that? She just went... <laughs> um... Why do you want to get well, in? that's the only way to become a Sith, isn't it? In the Academy, you learn to use the Force. 
What do you think your chances are? I thought they were good, but I've been here for days now and I haven't drawn any attention at all. I suppose that she might was be good. She was crazy chill, bro. <laughs> Some of the attention I'm the glad I'm not the only one who saw that then. Pretty <laughs> deadly. All right. What is it? I wish I knew to tell you the truth. You have to impress one of the Sith, I guess. Either way, it's you throw a bomb. All right, and makes so she's telling decision. me the same she's stuff a that the other guy master, told me. I hear. Very high rank. She's the one who decides which hopefuls make it in and which ones don't. I really couldn't say. I hear that sometimes she comes out into the colony to drink at the cantina, though. But I guess she could be anywhere. All right. All right. Good talk. Goodbye. 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 Is this the cantina? Exit from Drush Day. Then what's in here? What? I already talked to you. Hey there. What can I do for you? No, what can I do for you? I want to know a little bit more about you, I guess. Me? You want to know about me? Nobody's ever really been interested in me before. What do you want to know? How did you and Zalbar hook up? Big yeah, C's my let's family, you know? My parents, well, I guess they're dead. It was just me on my own until the day I saw Zalbar in the lower city. I could tell right away he was in trouble. This was before the gang wars were out of hand. But even then, <laughs> yeah. the vulgars were quote, scum. Hook up. A few of them were hassling Big Z, <laughs> trying to pick a fight, but he wasn't looking for trouble. Is this why Mission ran so close behind me when talking to the other Twi'leks? She was like, no, pay attention to me. I want to talk to you instead. Talk to me, talk to me, talk to me. And now I'm talking to her because she forced me to. Who'd want to pick a fight with a Wookiee? Hey, nobody said the Vulgars were smart, but there were three of them. So maybe they figured they could handle him. I don't know. Anyway, I don't like the Vulgars at the best of times. And when I saw them picking on this poor Wookiee, all alone on a strange planet, overwhelmed by the big city, I just lost it. I screamed out, leave him alone, you core slimes, and charged right at them. Well, one of them saw me coming and slapped me so hard he just about knocked me cold. Uh, you're lucky he didn't fry you with a blaster. Hey, I don't Let's need keep a going with the story. You ain't my mother. I knew what I was doing. Those Vulcans didn't scare me. They're nothing but cowards. I knew how to deal with them. Of course, I never got the chance. I guess Zalbar didn't like <laughs> seeing me get smacked around. He let out Maybe? the cow and yanked that Vulcan a meter mother. up off the ground and held him there by his throat. Did Zalbar kill him? Are you kidding? Big Z ain't like that. It's just a big old softy inside. Of course, oh, big the Vulgars didn't know that. The okay, other two softy. screamed and ran <laughs> off. Can't say I blame them. The first time you see an angry Wookiee up close, it isn't a pretty sight. I thought Zalbar was gonna rip that punk's arms off and beat him to death with his own fists. The Vulgar was so scared, he fainted. Or maybe it was Big Z's breath just knocked him out. Keep telling Zalbar to brush those shoppers of his, but he never listens. Just stay up wind when he speaks you, you'll be fine. To talk. Anyway, I knew those vocals would be back with friends, so I grabbed Zalbar and we took off. Ever since then, we've been a team. We look out for each other, you know? Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Um, we should get back to the task with the hand. I'll yeah, you. I suppose you're right. Like I used to tell my brother, fast talk and slick words don't get the job done. I didn't know you My had a brother. My brother's a touchy oh, subject. Oh no, you know? I did the wrong so choice happens, though. I, I don't think. really feel like talking about it. She's right gonna now. keep talking. Nothing personal. Let's just get back to the business at hand, okay? I have a Sith Academy to get into, my dear. Who are these peeps? Should I talk to all of them? Oh, is this a Cantina? I don't think so. Who are you? Are you willing to get. No, I don't want to play this game. Uh, no, bye. You're the owner of the Ebon Hawk, yes, or its latest owner, at least I'm honored to meet you. Oh my god, look at this emote I was gifted, I love it. I thought I was recognizing her. Was she the one Twi'lek I just talked to? Something about the Ebon Hawk? Patisa, Patisa. Only what I hear from the Ebon Hawk has been a frequent visit visitor to Portland in the past, though often with a different honor. Oh, fun. 
journal entry updated or added both <laughs> okay so i don't see Ooh, a crate but let's open it talk to... i haven't talked to either of those four yet but i want to open this crate first stuff stop Greetings, friend. Fellow pilot, are you? Wouldn't mind taking a spin in the Ebon Hawk myself. Sleek ship, that one. Uh, does everyone here know about the Ebon Hawk? In a small colony like this, everyone knows everyone's business. It's better than thinking too much about all the Sith lurking about here. The Hawk's been in and out of here for ages. And out of the way, Starport is a good place for, uh, privateers. Not saying you are one. Oh, just a boring freighter. We've had some pretty steady work here, though, since the Sith started their excavations up on the surface. In case you're forgetting, partner, they don't exactly want us talking about their business. Ah, who cares about them? I've seen some of those things they're digging up in those ruins in the valley. Pretty creepy, if you ask me. What have they been digging up? Weird artifacts. Looks like alien stuff. Maybe aliens lived on Korriban a long time ago. Who knows? Don't be stupid. I was talking to one of those Sith, and he said there are tombs there dating back to when the Sith were here in ancient times. There were Sith here in ancient times? Sounds like he was feeding you a line. Korriban's only been settled for a short time. So says you. He said the planet was settled by the Sith a long time ago. And then they all left or something. Those tombs are really important to him. Tombs, eh? That makes the stuff they send us even creepier. Wish I didn't have to haul it around. Uh, do you have any of these artifacts now? No, we're not due for another shipment for at least another week. Uh, where do you take these we things? We used to haul everything to Terrace, and the Sith would take it off our hands there. Not sure where we'll be bringing it now. How would... 
one get to these ex excavations exactly? It's in a valley on the surface, beyond some mountains to the east. No land route. That's why they have us fly in. Shows what you know. The academy has a route through the mountain. That's how all their students get to the excavation site. I'm assuming well, that's the regardless, is. the Sith don't let anybody near that valley. Even when we land, they watch us like a Drebarian hawk and want us gone quickly. So no one could sneak into the valley by ship? Not a chance. You'd be better off sneaking through the academy if you want to go to the valley. Ha! Now that'd be a sight to see. <laughs> all right. Sure Works thing. Good flying, friend. Oh, all the information. Cool, cool. What about these guys? One of Korriban's primary trade routes went through Terrace. Right. Now that it's destroyed. What? Mission! I'm busy. What? Hey there. I want to talk to you about your brother. Uh... I, I was a little snappish when we last talked. I'm sorry about that. I get a little touchy when it comes to Griff. It's kind of embarrassing telling people about him. Oh, is it now? Why? It's complicated. Griff wasn't the most popular guy. He had his faults. But I still loved him, you know? Sometimes people don't understand. I never knew my parents. My brother always looked out for me. He's the one who brought me here to Tars. I was just a kid, only five. But I remember the trip, if you could call it that. We were stuffed inside a packing crate in the Starfighter's cargo hold with just enough food and water to make the trip. Not exactly first class, you know? Stowaways! I don't know the whole story. I was pretty young, but my brother owed a lot of money. Might even have been a few arrest warrants out for him, I don't know. The only way to get off the planet was to smuggle ourselves out. I mean, I don't want to make it sound like we were criminals. Well, maybe my brother was. See, this is why I don't like to talk about it. It makes Griff sound worse than he really was. My brother had his problems, but he always looked out for me. You just sound confused in my opinion. Um... He's your family, you have to stick by your family. What kind of problems does your brother have? Sure, I'll, I'll ask. What problems? He gambled and drank. Fun, and fun. he was always borrowing money for his latest get-rich-quick scheme. Mm -hmm. But he had a good heart, you know? He taught me how to survive. He showed me how to slice into a computer security system, how to get inside a locked building without the entrance codes, and how to spot a wealthy mark for a quick shell game. <laughs> pretty, pretty handy skills to have. Yeah, Griff did right by me. I really miss him since he left. I keep hoping he'll come back someday. He promised me he would. Oh, he's alive. Why do you leave? He fell in with a bad crowd. It's all Lena's fault. She's the one who took him from me. Just batted those long lashes at him and off he went. Oh boy. Uh, let's get back to the mission. Mission, mission. Is that supposed to be a joke? Like I've only heard that about a million times in my life. Okay, I can take a hint. You don't want to hear anymore. That's just fine. Dude, I'm just I don't trying want to, talk to play about the Griffin game! Luna. Just the thought of that space tramp makes my blood boil. Subject's closed, as far as I'm concerned. If I'm gonna be any help to you, I can't be worrying about my brother running off with some intergalactic skank. So is there something else you need? No. Let's, let's go. Okay, <laughs> have it your way. Are we good? Or are you gonna stop me again? All right, let's just save that. Because that was fun. Intergalactic skank. That is an insult to hang on to for somebody. Where am I? Utility droid. Yay, droids! Ooh, ooh a box! Stuff? Stuff. I like stuff. Anything in here? No. Okay. Are they following me? Don't follow me. Stuff? Hey. Okay. Keep on going. Should probably save again. I have a feeling I'm about to encounter something. You. 
I remember you. What are you doing here? Did the Jedi Council send you? I swear I will expose you if they have. I don't remember her. Who is she? <laughs> I already don't remember people. Um. Uh, no, I'm gonna try persuading her. I see. Oh. So you have come to join the Sith as I have. I should have known that would happen, as should the Council. The Council is nothing but a slow and doddering farce. Oh, was she the all one that yelled at me you. for killing Juhani? And you failed them, just as you failed Juhani. Uh, Do you even yeah. remember me? I am Belaya, and it is your murder of Juhani that brought me here. Fortunately, <gasps> I have learned the power of revenge. I'm the good old god. Oh, what have I done? This is what I have done. I aspire to be one. I, I pissed her off. I pissed her off greatly. Let's she stunned me! Yeah. Whoa! Now yeah. that must have worked. Now that must have worked. Um, You'll never get me! Hey, I got a wound on her! And now she's dead. She couldn't get you. <laughs> she came for me, all right. That was <laughs> that was something. But uh, I win. Uh, should I talk to you guys? Why not? Leave me be. Can't you see that I'm busy? Are you from the academy? Isn't that obvious? You must be very sharp to possess such an astute sense of perception. Obviously death, however, since I asked you to leave. Wow, you're a dick. No, you may not. I'm busy amusing myself, and I'm not going to miss any of the fun. Now get lost before I teach you a lesson. Wow. Fun. How about you? I have to stand at attention. Please don't distract me, whoever you are. This bitch is rude AF. All right, um, I'm gonna leave them all alone because none of them want to talk to me, I guess. Uh, let's try. Right. Was I, did I, but I didn't find her at the, uh, cantina. Why are you not using the vr vr sword? <laughs> because I like using the blaster and I put all of these skills into using a blaster that I feel like it doesn't make sense. I like, I feel like it doesn't make sense to use the, uh, the lightsaber. Because, yeah. It's just not, I just, cantina sign. The drunk side. Ha! I like it. Where's this twilight lady? Is it you? It's probably not. But I don't see. Right? Because she's a twilight. Uh, blah, 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 blah. You will have to be approved by one of the Sith as a worthy hopeful, the one who does the deciding of which hopefuls make it is a Twi'lek Sith master by the name of Yuthura Bon. She can reportedly be sometimes found in Colony's Cantina. You should check there. I am here. Did I miss something when I was first in here? Um, any other new things I can talk about? No. He just wants to play a card game. I suppose you've heard about terrorists being destroyed. The Republic must have pushed the Sith into it, that's what I think. They have nothing to really say. You're on the Ebon Hawk, don't you? Wish I nice to see you again. Hold on to- Uh, he's got nothing. So what am I missing? She's not here. Like it's her. What do you want? 
it. Oh, thanks for the host. Uh, Meek? Is that the name? Can I ask you some Not questions? Much I can tell you. Yes. Uh, what do you mean? Uh, there are people who come here all the time to get into the Sith Academy. I'm one of them. I think I talked to her, though. Yeah. All right. And I talked to you. I've had two friends killed by the Sith already. It must be some kind of test. Talk to him. I'll survive and make Am it. Am I missing yeah. something already here? Maybe I could at least go back and, uh... This is not a real door. Yes? Hey there, what can I do for you? I'm sorry for the way I acted before. It's just that when it comes to Lena, I tend to get a little worked up. Hey, have a nice stream. Thanks! I really appreciate it. What did she do to you? My brother and me had a good thing going. Sure, Griff had his run-ins with the law on Terrace, but we got by okay until Lena came and ruined everything. She gets worked up when she it comes to She was a dancer at the cantina where my brother used to go play Pazic. Griff could be a real smooth talker, and it wasn't long before the two of them were dating. But Lena was used to dating rich Theresian nobles, guys with mountains of credits. Griff could never give her the lifestyle she was used to, no matter how hard he worked. Did she dump him? I thought Lena would brush Griff off when she saw how poor he was, but for some reason, she stuck around. I guess she saw the potential for a big payday down the road. Maybe she actually liked it. I saw Lena for what she really was, a busty, credit-grubbing cantina rat. She used Griff and took away the only family I had. After they'd been together for a few months, Griff told me he was leaving Terrace. He and Lena were gonna try and make their fortune off-world. He promised She's as soon as jelly. he made enough credits, he'd come back and get me. And we'd all live like royalty. But that was two years ago. I haven't seen him since. I don't even know yes, where he went. I know. <laughs> that sounds fun. <laughs> uh maybe something happened. Oh, I to know him. what happened. I'm gonna keep as soon talking as she got to him her off at tars, this point. Uh, Lena sunk her claws uh, until into she's done good. because she twisted him she's around her little finger and made him forget all about me. It. I know I'll probably never see Griff again. But part of the reason I came with you was to hope that I could find out what happened to my brother. Don't worry. I won't let the search for Griff get in the way of what we're doing. Let's just get back to the task at hand. Is there anything else I can help you with? Oh, now you're done talking? Do you, are you sure? Do you know anything about the planet? I don't know anything about Korriban, but I get a bad feeling in this place. If there's such a thing as an evil planet, this is it. Sorry Helpful. I can't be more help, you know? Is there anything else I can do for you? No, are you done talking okay. to me? Have it your way. <laughs> Why do all of my companions almost rub me the wrong way? <laughs> Did I talk to this dude? Go about your business, please, citizen. I did now. Um. Is there someone I did not talk to? I went the wrong way. I don't think I'm missing anybody. Game? I went the wrong way again. I'm pretty sure. Are you trying to make friends at school on your first day at the academy? I don't know. Uh, you know what? I could... The only people I did not talk to were the other Sith hopefuls. I could try to talk to the rest of them and see what happens. Maybe bothering them will have me get their attention. From somebody. Let's try that. Because those are like... Or I haven't tried talking to these droids either. Hello. I cannot render assistance, citizen. Beep, beep, boop, boop. Okay. Um, he wouldn't answer my questions. Let's try this guy again. What are you doing? If we stood here long enough, we would be worried. <laughs> what? Me trying to make friends is a weakness? 
We've been here for so many days. I'm so hungry. Some some of us have died, but I must be strong. I must. I will keep standing. Who put you up to this? I don't need friends. They disappoint me. They were watching us from over there. He said this is how we prove our worth. We must be strong. They go we will be worthy soon, I hope. Oh, is this the guy? Yeah. What are you doing? You'll get your turn soon enough, fool. And when you do, I will be there laughing as you collapse from heat exhaustion and Meikle's beatings. All right. Please, don't hurt me. I am too weak with hunger. Okay. Oh, there's a Twi'lek here. Hi. You are neither a Sith, nor do you bear the medallion. Oh, could have just talked to this dude. Ooh, let's force persuade. That should be fun. Let me inside. I have been conditioned to resist mental persuasion, citizen. That didn't Please work. do not attempt that again. Uh... Let's try persuading. No one gets inside, citizen. <laughs> Messages and deliveries must be relayed through official Sith channels only. Uh... What's this medallion? It's a device given to one who has been accepted into the academy, but has not yet proved their worth as a student. If one of the Sith decides you are worthy, you will be given one, which you must then take to Yathora Ban, who I believe is in the cantina. It is she who decides which hopefuls enter the academy. How do I become a Sith then? You must be admitted to the academy. That decision must be made by a Sith who has already been accepted here. The final decision, however, remains with Master Yuthura. I believe she is currently at the cantina. If I you don't wish to seek her see out. her unless no, no. I am blind. Or is she there now? I should probably check to see if she's returned. I'm gonna talk is to there her something again. specific? Are you making? And what if I am? Um. Uh, why are you making them stand? That over is there? the whole point. Personally, I think it's wonderful fun. Those fools actually think that if they stand there long enough, I'll let them become a Sith. Idiots. A Sith is not a bantha, all endurance and no brains. A Sith would fight for his life, no matter the odds. If these rot grubs are as stupid as they seem, then they deserve their fate. Man, so this is this isn't the real test for them. Then I demand you stop this at once. Wouldn't it just be more merciful to kill them? Sounds like fun. Uh, I guess so. It's not really a real test. Oh, it's a test, all right. It's a test to see if they're actually fool enough to die. If they don't, however, I certainly wouldn't admit them just for that accomplishment. Oh, what a sweet guy. He should get the Sith Congeniality Medal. <laughs> hmm. It is a bit boring standing out here all day, however. I think I'll go for some dinner. It will be fun to think of them while I gorge myself. They'll still be here in an hour or two, surely. I suggest you run along before I decide to make you part of the fun. I'd rather kill you, but okay. Alright, well... Let's go back to the cantina, I guess. Maybe now she'll be there. I wonder if it was one of those things where I just had to talk to everybody before she showed up. Ah! Yes! You're new! Hello! Let's save the game. <laughs> Is there something you need, human? Ooh. Make it good, for I have little patience. She's cool. I like the tattoos. Uh, Karth, calm yourself. Are you Yathura Bond? Yep. I am. Obviously, you have been told of me. 
Is it your desire then to train at the Academy? Do you wish to become a Sith human? Maybe. Why would I want to join the Sith? Maybe I haven't given it much thought. Yes, that's exactly why I'm here. Let me join you. Wait, wait, so like, can you be? <laughs> like, if I act, can you actually become a Sith in this game? Or is your, is the whole plot just you being a Jedi to, uh, um, to find the Starforge and stuff? I like that guy's goggles. <laughs> Cards. Maybe I haven't given it much thought. Let's, let's see. What Yet here you are in Little Korriban just by accident. I find it hard to believe. If it amuses you, however, I'll play along. Only one we way to find out. We wield ultimate power, True. my friend. To be a Sith is to taste freedom and to know victory. Nothing is as glorious as bending the Force to your will. Your voice is too. <laughs> Thanks. A lot of hopefuls here end up dead. That doesn't seem glorious. Yeah, sure. We make no apologies for the weak. If you cannot clench your fist and know when the moment comes to strike, there is no place for you amongst us. Fair. Of those who come to train, those who are weak return home. If they are both weak and foolish, they die. But it was their choice to come. I really like, like, her tattoos and her skin, like, her whole color scheme. That's super cool. Ah, uh, but you serve the dark side of the force, don't you? And where does Darth Malik fit into all of this? That's an interesting question to suddenly ask. Um. Uh, I assume that I have to join in order to just fit in and get in. So. You've heard enough, have you? <laughs> so what is it to be? Are you here to be a Sith or not? No, I'm not interested. Yes, I want to join the Sith. Never mind, I have to go. I'm gonna say yes, because I mean... Ah, so you are just another hopeful after all. Or are you? I mean, I have There's to get in. That seems to be the only way so far, miss. so... <laughs> I sense we'll that happens. you are very strong in the Force. That you have already honed some of your abilities. Oh. Jedi training, is it? She sees right through me. Uh... What difference does it make? Perhaps none. Perhaps all the difference in the world. Either way, you possess enough raw power to intrigue me greatly. Eight. With that kind of power, you could Sith become a better great makeup Sith. And <laughs> Perhaps, if I let you. Does that interest you? Oh, with that kind of power, you could become a great Sith. Perhaps, if I let you. Does that interest you? Force persuade? I don't think that would work. I, like, I feel like she's high enough where me attempting that is not going to work. Um. Persuade lie. Yes, it does. I wish to become a Sith. Or persuade. Yes, I want to become a Sith. I assume maybe you're naturally more powerful than her. I don't know. I'm tempted to just try Force Persuade because why not? I have it. I can always try it. And if that doesn't work, then I'm assuming I'm between the Persuade and Lie and the Persuade. And I'm assuming that's a hard choice I need to make about my character if she actually would want to join the Sith or not, which I didn't think about. She's just kind of... I've just been kind of doing my own thing. I never thought about joining anybody. It's more just been like gotta do this and gotta do that to, to survive and move on. Let's try force persuading. <laughs> you must not think much of Sith Masters to try that little trick. I Big won't use. hold it against you, however. It shows initiative. But I do desire a real answer to my question. Does it interest you? I mean, worst case scenario, if I want to join the Jedi again, it's a forgive and forget situation, right? <laughs> Maybe? <laughs> but at the same time, I also already lied to the Jedi saying I would do their bidding and whatnot. Because I, 
I just say the things to just keep the keep it going and to just get through and get what I need and want. So let's just do number three as a regular persuasion, and we're just we're gonna see what happens. I mean, if if I would almost be surprised if this character doesn't become Sith anyways, because I already have so many dark side points on this character just by playing. <laughs> so this person is probably gonna end up being Sith, and this will be interesting as a first playthrough. Then I think. But anyways, number three. I see. Well, that Somehow. failed too. However, I am unconvinced. So... No, my friend. I'll not be the one to bring you into our academy. If one of the other Sith accept you and give you a medallion, then Maybe perhaps. that was... Maybe I thought too much about today. it. Maybe I was now. kind of bound to fail that. Because I probably... I wonder... Let's see. What does this say now? You have spoken with to the Sith Master, but she is not yet convinced that you are worthy to allow into the academy. She did mention that if one of the other Sith accepted you... And gave you a medallion, she might change her mind. I'm assuming that Melek guy I would need to talk to again. But he kind of left. Let's go back out there and kind of see what else happens. See if he returned or something. I probably thought way too much about that conversation. <laughs> I don't see him. Let's see if he is Ah card. Let's see if he is elsewhere. Droid. This looks fun. Hi! Friends! Hey, what's this? Looks like we found ourselves a bit of sport, my friends. Ever notice how the Sith always act tough when they're in groups? Nothing but scum, if you ask me. This is good. I want to celebrate my acceptance into the Academy. Oh, good, me she too. has a medallion. So how about Steal a chunk? It. Ready to die? I'm eager to blow off some steam after those tests. Oh good, I can get medallions for all of us. Uh, you sure you wanna uh, bring it on? Just, just bring it on. Kava tumpa kurpa yia moka pata. Yoka ku tumpa kurpa yia. You know it. Let's enjoy this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, how do I want to do this? Do they all have lightsabers? Yeah, looks like it. So they're all gonna be melee, huh? Um. Let's wound oh, oh. I'm gonna try to do that. Because oh, they hurt a lot. This might have been a bad idea. Hearth is incapacitated. Mission and I are already at half health. Oh I think Mission lost health in that last fight, and I didn't heal or anything either. Budge! I could throw grenades! Let's try that. I'll probably blow up mission, though. <laughs> uh, let's try some grenades. I only have frag grenades! Let's see how this works. Uh, um, I'm gonna do a med pack. Oh, I got no. Karth, I need some heal. Who's hurt? They're not nearly hurt enough. Fudge. <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> Let's try to give Karth a med pack. And um, let's try to focus actually on pe specific people. Ready. 
avoid that fight yeah I have some health down yeah and mission has some health down. all right and so what yeah let's do that I have energy shields I am so I can't believe I always forget I have energy shields. Those will probably come in handy. The issue is that they also all have lightsabers and those are powerful too. Hey, what's this? I'll figure it out. This meat. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, are you sure you want to die? I think that was a threat. That's pretty funny. Why should we be scared of you? Take another sip and I'll show you because I've killed plenty of Sith before now. Run along because I'm not a snot nosed punk who's biting off more than he can chew. Let's try that one. Okay, I've heard just about enough out of you. Get him! Yeah, that's a fight. Okay. Um. Karth. Whoa, spins. Let's try to get Mission to fight that guy. And I'm gonna try to Ready. move back. Karth is incapacitated. Let's try two grenades. Yeah. I'm dumb. Now that must be. Let's get her. Let's try to walk. Oh! Energy shields! God! I need Karth to do that. I need me to do that. Here's this. Uh, and then we'll try a cure. Okay, I'm la- I was just about to say I'm lasting a little longer, but... Mission just went down, so this is not. Oh my goodness. Um. I'm about to lose Karth, and there's nothing I can do about it. Shoot. I wonder if I could just ultimately avoid this fight. I'm starting to get the feeling I am not prepared. <laughs> Wait, did he heal? No. Thanks for the follow. Oh, we got a follow. Thanks for the follow. Uh, fee, fee gear time? Something like that. Sorry if I butch butchered the name. Oh. Eh. Okay. Let's try mm, avoiding the fight. Hey, what's that? Me too. I don't want to pick a fight. But we. Hundred credits or force persuade. Hi, I'm good. How are you? I think I'll try the force persuade. Although that hasn't worked yet. But maybe they're weaker. Yeah. Oh, it don't worked. Fight you. Hey, that's a Jedi trick. No, what? It's you, not. You won't get away with this. Oh, fudge. <laughs> uh, okay. Here's what I'm gonna do. Shield. 
Shield. Shield. Oh, fudge. I'm dumb. Uh, shield, right? Let me, there we go. And then you're just gonna throw grenades. And then, um, you are going to, oh, okay. Let's do, I want the master sniper because that has the chance to stun. Actually, I should probably try the wounds first and then I'll do that. And then you, shield, maybe, come on. I need this to pop up, there we go. And we're gonna, we're just gonna slash. <laughs> There we go. The combat always seems so complex. Hi, Kevin! <laughs> oh, they are both incapacitated. How am I supposed to... Eh. Okay, let's try this one. It is like driving... Oh, oh, no. um, is that I have a knack for missing because of the D20 system. Ready. Yeah, yeah. okay. Oh god, mission, I need you. Stop. Mission, stop. barely get one down for whatever reason oh you know what I should probably stick with attacks because they are getting the penalties down that way okay I got one down mission is still alive why she's not healing yourself, I have no idea why. Why are you not? You're the leader. Oh yeah, you should be. Okay. Um, let's get you a med pack. And you can attack her. And then let's have you attack that one. <laughs> You are not attacking the right one. And mission doesn't need any more med packs now. Attack this one. Huh? Uh, uh, who is a card attacking? I think you just healed yourself. Ready. Okay. And then, alright! Okay, we're making some, some headway now. I need you to attack this person like the rest of your grow! Yeah. Health like a hawk. Because I have the med packs. You are attacking the wrong person. And then let's get mission one. They all just want to attack this thug leader, but I want to get the other ads down first. Yeah? Please attack her. Do the freaking thing. You. I, so I'm playing Dragon Age 2 right now, um, just on my own time, and what the biggest pet peeve in these games is when I d tell a character to do something, and then I switch to another character, and then I go back to that original character, and that character is not doing what I tell him to do, and it's always who to focus on. I'm here. <laughs> it's like, how hard is it to tell them who to focus? 
Okay, that's another down though. So let's attack her. Or this guy, I mean. She's down. I got, Karth probably is about to need another med kit. Uh, I also like how it's always like third time. Oh, he's almost down, I guess. So you know what, fine, whatever. Yeah, you guys can just. I don't know if this is, yeah. Um, we're gonna watch Kara thinking. Huh? He's gonna need one, and Mission's gonna need one. Just to be on the safe side. What's, what's Mission doing? Yeah? Okay, she healed herself. Alright! One more down! Let's do this! Oh, she needs a med kit. Karth needs a med kit. <laughs> I'm so glad I bought all of these med kits! Okay, I did it! Whew! Jeez, I think... Wow, that might have been... I don't think that was supposed to be that hard, but it was. Yay, a medallion! So I should have that now. So I can go to... Back to... What's her face? Um, you know, do I have... That's what I thought. I don't have any sort of hideout or anything to just go back and heal. Unless I can go back to the Ebonhawk, which I probably could for that quest. Because I did go through a lot of med packs. For that. Um... Eh. Let's just see what happens. Ah! Citizen, jump in! Okay. How are you, Kevin? Happy Friday! And happy Friday to everyone who I didn't say happy Friday to. I got really caught up in the game here. How's everybody doing? And I hope you're all doing well. And hope we're all excited. It's the weekend. And does anybody have any big plans for the weekend? Yo, I got a medallion. You again. I have this medallion. So, one of the others accepted you, even after I did not. Hmm, you're lucky, human, for I'm in a forgiving mood. I will take you to the Academy, and we shall see if you are ready to join the ranks of the Sith. Yay! I have only one other question. These companions of yours, they will not be coming with you, I presume. They are slaves, don't worry about them! <laughs> I see. Fair enough. Yeah. So long as they say, do not disturb no your training or cause any trouble. Are you ready to go to the Academy, then? Yeah, let's go. Then let us leave. The Master of the Academy awaits you. I seriously like her character design. Like, it's inspiring me to make a character based off of the color scheme and the tattoos. Greetings, prospective like students. Like a D&D or Star Wars It appears Wars we have a late entry. Who do you bring before me, Uthura? A young human bristling with the Force? A human that has had some training, it seems, Master Uthar. Very promising, I think. Promising? I, that one's not worthy to lick spit off your shoes, Master. I met this one in the colony. Unworthy, if you ask me. That I'll judge for myself, thank you. Oh. Tell me, human, what do you know you of the, the ways of the sea? What preconceptions has your mind been polluted with? I've killed too many Sith to have preconceptions about them. <laughs> I don't know anything about the Sith, to tell the truth. I know the Sith are powerful, a force to be reckoned with. Sith are evil and have surrendered themselves to the temptation and corruption of their power. The Sith do what they want and pay no heed to duty or discipline. Ooh. Um. Let's do powerful and a force to be reckoned with. A diplomatic answer, if not the core of the matter. Our power is obvious. The question in truth goes indeed, much deeper dude. than the surface. The Jedi equate the light with goodness and strength, and the dark with weakness and evil. That is their tradition, and it is truly no surprise that they cling to it for comfort. We, however, do not treat the Force as a burden. We treat it as a gift, a thing to be celebrated. We use it to acquire power over others. And why should we not? Because the Jedi say we should not. We are as the Force is meant to be. The Jedi would hide that from you. They would tell you the dark side is too quick, 
too easy. All too so that easy. they need never challenge the passions that lie within them. Joining with us means realizing your true potential. It means not stifling yourself solely for the sake of hidebound shamans and their antiquated notion of order. Be what you were meant to be. What I say you, it. Lasher? Hidebound Are you ready shamans. to learn the secrets of the dark <laughs> the side? Of dare you? I oh, dare, order. Master Uthar. I am ready. Brash ready? and fiery, as expected. Turn that passion to your advantage, child. Sorry what of you, Meekle? Are noise. you ready? I am, Master. More than ready. I sense much anger within you, young one. That is good. That will provide you power. And Shardan, what of you? I am always ready. I see. You had best gather your wits for the trial ahead, boy, or you will not last. And you, young human, does this interest you? Are you ready to learn more of what I speak? Yeah, let's do this. Uh. But power without consideration. I don't know. Sure, I'm ready. And so shall it be. Now then. All of you five recruits have shown a degree of facility with the Force. You all have the potential to become true Sith. Only one of you, however, will succeed. And it the shall one be who me. succeeds will be admitted to the Academy as a full Sith. All others must wait until next year and try again, if you survive. My pupil, Euthura, shall be your teacher and master while you attempt to prove yourselves. Heed her words. As Master Uthar said, none of you are true Sith yet. For that to occur, one of you must do enough of worth, gain enough prestige to be selected. What is an act of worth? You must learn that for yourselves. Remember that you are competitors here. Fight for your destiny, or go home. If you wish to gain a lead over your competitors, the first of you to learn the code of the Sith and tell me of it will be rewarded. The rest is for you to discover. Welcome to the dark side, my children. Your one chance at true greatness lies here. Fun! You must strike down your master and claim their position. <laughs> like in Svotor. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, right. Okay. Alright. So, um, the way of the Sith! Managed to enter the Sith Academy as a hopeful vying with several others to become the one who finally be admitted as a full Sith. In order to do so, you must prove your worth to Master Uthar Win by gaining prestige. More information can be gained by speaking to your instructor, Uthura. Cool. Let's save. Saving is always good. Yeah. Ah, there Welcome you are. Welcome to school. My You're favorite prospect for Harry. the year. <laughs> I'm your favorite? Absolutely. By my estimation, you are far more likely to achieve the prestige necessary to join the Sith than any of the others. As a matter of fact, I am so certain of that that I'm willing to offer you an opportunity of the once-in-a-lifetime variety. Would you like to hear it? Uh, uh, do I have a choice? Mm, not really. <laughs> oh, don't worry. Yeah, I saw that coming. What I have in mind will benefit us both. You can be sure of that. As I said, you're no doubt going to be the one whom Uthar chooses to become a Sith. With my help, of course. This Once that occurs, hey, he will take dogs? you into the Valley of the Dark Hi, Lord, it to the is, tomb of uh, Nagus Sado, to administer the How final you? test. Welcome. There you and I will be alone with him. I like her character. The perfect time to, Yithuras, Matt, shall we say, arrange yeah, for a change awesome. in the Academy's leadership? Yeah! What's so important about this tomb? The I tomb wasn't is listening. an ancient ruin on the surface that was visited years ago by Darth Revan and Darth Malak. They discovered a star map there of great importance. Hey! Darth Malak went there? Very interesting, isn't it, Master? Reaching that map as they did is part of the final <laughs> test. Off. At any rate, like, it is not the tomb that is important. Why did you tell me I'm your That slave? Uthar will be alone is what is important. You want me to kill Master U Ooh, the plot dickens. I love this. I love this a lot, actually. Uh, what's to stop me from telling him about this? And what's your part in this? How do I know this isn't some test? Ooh, you want me to kill him? Is that such a daunting prospect? It is not as if I'm asking you to perform the task alone. Or as if you will get nothing out of it. Master Uthar cannot prevail against us both. That's all there is to it. It is a very simple matter. Um. 
How do I know this isn't some test? <laughs> yeah, you must not chilling. know much this about game the Sith yet. Greatest game, greatest if games Uthar were even to this suspect that I might be Definitely. trying to supplant him, true or not, I enjoy well, playing this game let's a lot. just say he wouldn't likely stop to ask too many questions before ensuring I was dealt with. Um. Yeah, sure. Uh, what's your part in this, actually? My part in this is to help you gain enough prestige and slow down the progress of the other hopefuls. I want you in that tomb when the time is right. We destroy Master right. Uthar together and I take his place. And you take your place at my side. A beautiful plan in its sheer simplicity. All right, I'll help. Very well, I agree. I'm so glad you see it my way. Why I will not? begin to make preparations <laughs> for your final test. Your only worry now is to get there. Don't disappoint me. Cool, 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 cool. Um, can you tell me about the code of the Sith? I want to know more about these runes on the surface. Uh, all right, I'm probably going to be asking all of these, but let's start with. Let's just start from the top and go down. How do I get You must prestige? impress Master Uthar. Go to him with news of your deeds or artifacts you have discovered. The first and easiest way would be for you to learn the code of the Sith and speak it to him. I can teach you that if you like. Yeah, Shall teach I go me. on? Can you teach me code of the Sith? I can help you understand it. Would you like to hear it? Yeah. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, I gain power. Through power, I gain victory. Oh, crap. Through victory, my chains are broken. The Force shall free me. Simple words. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Would you care passion, for me to explain strength. anything? Through strength, I gain victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. And the force sets me free. Did I get that right? Simple words yet easily misunderstood. Would you care for me to explain anything? N no, I think I got it. I am not surprised. The force is... Um... Okay, I want to know more about these ruins on the surface. I have been involved in the work there over the last couple of years, but not often. Most of the excavating is left to the students. What did you wish to know? Is there any way into the tomb? Why are the Sith? Yeah, okay. Is there any way into the tomb of Naga S Naga S Sadao? Sado? Oh gosh, I don't remember these names. <laughs> Not unless you are accompanied by Master Uthar. No, it is strictly forbidden. And I truly doubt you could bypass the doors to the tomb with anything less than ship blasters. Even then, perhaps. Gotcha. Is there no other way inside? None. I do not even know how Master Uthar gains entrance, to tell the truth. Though I look forward look to discovering Look at all those cheer goblins! Fact. I love them! I have them. searched many times, so do not bother. There is no other way. Do Speaking not fret, of goblins, however. Simply get the prestige you need, and you will finish. see the tomb soon enough. Speaking of goblins, since we're here, uh, if you guys missed... If you are new to our stream, or if you guys missed um, our announcements from earlier this week, uh, we have two... Oh, there's not, the light's not good. Um, but these are our uh, Dice Goblin stickers that we uh, launched as part of our, of celebrating our one year of streaming here on Twitch. Um, we started with selling five of these. There are two left. And the big announcement about them uh, that started the beginning of this week is that now we ship these internationally. Uh, so if you are outside of the U.S. Um, and you are interested in these little guys, um, you can get one. So again, there are only two left. We started with limited stock on these guys um, just because of the special occasion. They are super adorable, and if you want to see more about them or uh, buy them, uh, we have a Twitch panel below in our About section about our uh, shop on coffee where you can uh, buy or even donate on coffee. Um, also in, uh, there's also a command if someone can do it to uh, do a direct link to the merch, that would be awesome and you can do it there. Um, the stickers, thank you, there it is, guys, Dice Goblin stickers. Um, the price is $2 for these, that's the minimum. Um, but it is set to a pay what you want so anything that you want to uh put toward these stickers that are more than two dollars is basically treated as a donation to the stream on coffee where it just helps us generally try to keep improving the stream 
in terms of quality and, you know, get more equipment for all of us. Um, since we are a group of people who stream together on this channel, make sure we're all at the same level of quality and whatnot. And, um, yeah, that's basically it. So we have two of these little guys left. They now can be shipped internationally, so get on it. And they are so cute. How could you not want one? I don't have the perfect lighting to kind of show you guys exactly what they look like. Um, but if you go to the link that's now in uh, chat from Nightbot, uh, you can see it. And they're so adorable. So yeah, speaking of goblins, what am I talking about? Why are the Sith interested in these ruins? We could learn much about the history of the ancient Sith. Why they were on Korriban and why they left. Perhaps we could learn more about the origin of the Force itself. With that knowledge could come great power. All right, that's you enough. Um, I'll be going. You have had an excellent start. All right, let's do the Sith code before I forget. Um, where is he? He's probably down this way. How big is this place? Where's my map? Nope, you're not the map. What's this? Okay, so I just kind of need to find him, I guess. Uthar. Hello? That's his room and it's locked. Let's not try to piss him off just yet. Is he... Sithgard? You're somebody. Where'd he go? Oh, a footlocker, though. On it. Damn! Oh, okay, I'll get to that later. I'm just trying to find him so I don't forget the Sith code. Or did I miss him and he was like right there? Oh. Did you guys hear that scream? Holy cow, that sounded terrible. Hello, there you are. Let's talk about the Sith code. Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little prestige. Um, I know the Sith code. Then finish the code as I speak it. Yeah, Peace Let's is a lie. It. That is only... Passion! Three! Through passion, I gain... Strength! Through strength, I gain... Victory! No, no, that Fudge. is incorrect. I would have thought merely recite... <laughs> Let's try again. Maybe I got too then excited. Then finish the code. Peace okay. is a lie. Okay, That is only... Uh, uh, passion. Through passion, I gain... Strength. Through strength, I gain... Oh, is it power? It's probably power. Through power, yeah, I gain... Yeah, then I gain victory. Through victory. Then, uh, my chains are broken. The force shall free me. Yeah, 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 yes, yeah, yeah. I only good. missed one. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speaking the words and knowing the words are, however... Two different things. Tell me then, true or false? It is our passion that fuels the force. I didn't study this part! Um... Yes. Well done. <laughs> I will test you no more. You know the code. <laughs> Very impressive. Go now. You have done well. I did it. But you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Where? Okay. Um... How do I... How do I get oh, more prestige for you? It is no more you? complicated than I said. Perform impressive deeds, or bring me a suitably valuable artifact from the Valley of the Dark Lords. Uh, oh, so it's a popularity contest, basically. Wonderful. Really, Let me ask however, you a single you question about Uthura the meaning of the advice. code. Yeah. She is your trainer, <laughs> after all. Yes? Okay. Uh, where is the valley? There is an exit that leads to the surface of the planet. The valley is only a short trip from there. It is not difficult to find. That was the test. <laughs> um, I want to know more about you? You wish to know more about me, do you? And why would I indulge your idle curiosity? Will we be good friends, you think? I, I strived know. many years to hone my power, until I was able to drive out my predecessor and rule the Academy. If you are smart, Force you will aim to do the you. same, or better. There is nothing else you need to know. Do not ask again, young one. All right, uh, um, we're gonna go now, bye. Very well, you have impressed me. 
definitely a good start. Hey, I impressed him. Okay, so it sounds like I can go ahead and make my way. Whoa. The double cross. Star map, Corbon. Um, but it sounds like I can already make my way to the ruin. Um, let me double check if that's the case. Uh, it is not enough yet for him to declare you the victor, speak to Yathura, or continue to look around the academy and the Valley of the Dark Lords to find ways to carry. Okay, what's this double cross? Yathura Ban, Ban has chosen you to be part of her plot to overthrow Master Uthar and take over the academy, and she didn't give you much choice in the matter. Yathura will help you gain enough prestige to be worthy of the final test at the tomb, and there she expects you to help her kill Master Uthar. Yep, okay. And then at the tomb is uh, the star map. So, okay, so I'm gonna... I pretty much talked to uh, Yathura about everything other than trying to get to know her. So I can try that. But otherwise, it looks like I need to talk to everybody here. So, yeah. Let's... Why is this place confusing me? So let's just finish talking to her then. I understand you have impressed Master Uthar at least a little. That is good. We are one step closer toward completing my plan. Yeah. Were I you, I would not get too excited just yet. You still have plenty left to do. Okay. Um, tell me about yourself. About myself? I'm originally from Slaheron, if you must know. I was a slave to a cruel master, Omish the Hutt. I'm sure you don't need to know more. Um, alright, that's it. You I'll have had an now. excellent start. Go, gain more prestige. Alright, so we're gonna just... Let's look at the map here. Bedroom. Oh, I assume this is the hideout now, basically. The new hideout for myself. What's in this footlocker? Stuff? Stuff! Ooh, a dark Jedi Knight robe. Why does that interest me so much? That would be fun, wouldn't it? Okay, are, are you guys hearing these screams? J-Force, hi! Kill everyone! <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Does this foot locker open? No, okay. Um, all right, so I'm just gonna try to go through this whole place and talk to everybody. Um. I want this. Damn! Damn! Okay. So let's try to- I assume talking to everybody just picks up a bunch of side quests. So let's oh, try- Oh, uh, hello. Yeah. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Alguin. Sup? I, see, I hope I'm not the only one that's hearing these in the background. They're very faint, but... <laughs> uh, is something wrong? I- oh, uh, nothing. Are you sure? Uh, yes. My master always says I'm too trusting. Too willing to show weakness. You're a Sith, so I, I really shouldn't, you know. Uh, but I'm not a Sith. Oh, I know yet. that. I mean, you aren't yet, but you intend to be. I mean, you're just like everyone else here. Um, and you're not. Well, I, 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 I didn't mean it like that. Well, how did you mean I, it then? I, I shouldn't the trust you. The screams are normal. <laughs> I can't trust you. Can I? Sure you can. Oh, force persuade. Yeah, force persuade. I just oh, don't yes. think I belong here. I thought maybe I did at first, but now I, I don't know. I have so many doubts. Um, Master Uthar probably wouldn't like to hear that. If it doesn't feel right, then perhaps you don't belong here. Everybody has doubts. Keep it up. You'll come around. Is that it? Don't bother me with your petty weaknesses. Um, if it doesn't feel right, then perhaps you don't belong here. But where would I go then? What would I do? I don't know. Have you thought about the Jedi? It doesn't matter. Have you considered that the dark side just isn't your way? Leave, obviously, you're not ready to be a Sith. You'll wind up dead. I'll do option number two. Uh, yeah, maybe you're right. Uh, I'll go and tell Master Uthar that I'm not ready for this. Maybe it won't be so bad. Thank, thank oh, you. son, you gonna die. <laughs> Bye. Oh, hello again. Oh, no, I didn't mean to talk to you uh, again, but you, uh, um, what just happened here? Unfin 
quest for the Star Forge. Unfinished business. Oh, did that not work? Okay, never mind. I guess that didn't do much. But you're no. Oh, did I accidentally oh, stop hello again. you? I. Oh, am I doing this whole thing again? I just don't. Uh, if it doesn't feel but right, then I... leave. If it doesn't matter. Uh... Okay. There we go. All right. Um, he was right there. What's over here? With the Sith guard. Hello. Greetings, student. Oh, okay, fine. Oh, and here's this footlocker. Again. On it. Oh, I didn't have skill for this. Damn. Let's bash it. Do the bash! Am I no. not? I don't think so. I'm just doing crappy damage to it. Oh my god! Now that must have hurt. Jeez! Oh, I didn't even see what I got. Oh, oh. I did not even see what I got. But okay, we're good now. Alright, next. Oops, I already went here. I was not paying attention. Alright, now we turn this way. Alright, and what is down here? Ah, yes, that guy. Let's go down here first. Footlocker? Darn. I'm pretty sure that guy that I talked to and said, yeah, don't worry about it. Yeah, I remembered that right when um, I finished. <laughs> Beating that up. So, oops. I'll keep that in mind for next time. Um, I'm pretty sure that guy I just talked to is gonna die. Let's talk to him next. It's a bad year to try and become a Sith, you know. I've got it all wrapped up. Oh, you're so cocky. Um, what makes you so sure? You think I would tell you? Have my brain started dribbling out of my nose or something? It would be an improvement. <laughs> uh, maybe we can trade information? Ooh. Hmm. I've got my own plans. I've got to go. It would be an improvement. What should I say? I've got my own plans. Yeah, so I see. I'll be keeping my eye on you. No, I want more You're from hanging? you. Uh, I'm the one who's gonna make Maybe. it. Maybe. You're not doing too bad, I suppose. I know something you don't, though. Oh, is that so? You're lying. Think I what you tell. like. Just remember, only one of us gets to become a sin. Oh God, you're hanging it. around. Okay, you know what? Um, what makes you, you so sure? I'm Maybe we can trade information. <laughs> There's nothing you know that I could possibly want. Thanks, anyhow. You hanging around? St Mm-hmm. Persuade. I could. Failed. But what would be the point in that? All right, dick. See ya. Let's talk to you. Nothing in that folder. You? Locker. I remember you from the colony. I can't believe you actually made it into the academy. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. I challenge you to a duel? Ooh. That sounds fun. Who are My you? My name is Lasho. Remember it, for I'll be the one who earns the prestige to move on. You'll have to be satisfied with next year, I suppose. You're trying to become Sith as just well? Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> it just so happens that I have a surefire way of pulling ahead in this little contest of ours. You don't really have a chance. Am I dueling her? You talk big, but that's about uh -uh. it. Uh-uh. Well, you may be the competition, but I've still got the edge on you. I'm gonna duel her. You? <laughs> Why not? I challenge you to a duel! A duel? Fine. You run along and get ready while I go gain some prestige. Idiot. 
Oh, that didn't work. Okay, I don't know. Uh, what's next? Hi! Woohoo! If it isn't the freak from the colony. Hello, freak. Wow, you're a dick too. They're all dicks! You want to make an issue out of and it? And go into the dueling room? <laughs> I've got better things to do than give you a fair fight. You can count on seeing me later, though. My lightsaber has your name on it. Okay. I have a feeling I'm going to the dueling room. So that all worked. Out. Maybe. Uh, where next? What's up here? Oh, I hear some students. Greetings. You're one of the new hopefuls, aren't you? I imagine you're eager to garner some prestige from Master Uthar. Oh, I guess I should have talked to these guys instead. <laughs> Um, I am. Anything you can help me with? Mm -hmm. Now that depends. Do you know anything about Ajuntapal? No. Ajuntapal was one of the first of the great Sith Lords. At least, according to the ruins here on Karaban. One of the tombs out in the Valley of the Dark Lords belongs to him. He wielded a powerful sword, by all accounts. Some of us believe it might be in that tomb, which is quite exciting. His sword. According to legend, a Junta Paul forged a sword imbued with the essence of the dark side. Someone who found it could gain considerable prestige. Um. So, oh, okay. Has and hasn't any effort been made to recover it? Some unsuccessful attempts have been made. I truly don't know why a more concerted effort isn't made, however. How do I get to this valley? You simply need to follow the East Passage. There's an exit there which will lead you up to the surface. Look for Tariga. She is in that area and can probably help you. All right, all right, all right. I'll be going now. Thanks. I imagine you've got a lot to do. Journal entry added. Do you have anything you How to say? How do you do, hopeful? Seeking prestige. Yes. Can you help me? Do you know of our renegade students? No. Ah, let me tell you what I can, then. A group of students were ordered to perform executions on civilians within the colony. They refused to carry out the orders. Master Uthar naturally ordered them killed, but they fled before this could take place. If one could carry out Uthar's order, it would be worth considerable Alrighty. prestige. Cool, kill people. There are five of them, if I remember. And they cannot be far, as they have no method to leave the planet. Likely hiding in the hills on the surface. Now, if you will excuse me, I must return to my studies. I should be getting, yeah. These should be side quests now. Um, right. I was gonna check up here. Hello. I have a feeling this is an entryway? Sith teacher. Sith student. This place is huge! Or is it just huge to me? What's this way? Sith guard. What are you? Door to valley. Alright, good to know. We're fine. Everything's fine. How do you do? Yeah, sure, can you help do me? You know of I do know of them. Yep, those yep. Are the one. There is little more I can tell you then. Should you locate their hiding place, you would gain yeah! Yes, I'm talking to somebody! Now, if you will excuse me. Okay. It's my most fervent hope to serve under Darth Malak once my training is complete. Don't you feel soon? There are some students in hiding that refuse to follow an order. Master Uthar wants them found yeah. and dead. He's offering more. Alright. Another student wandering about the hey, academy. Hey, calm down! I am trying! I suppose you want to know to how to, to get somebody. prestige. Yes, <laughs> As if I didn't have better things to do. Has anyone told you about Jorak Um? No. Well, 
The first thing you should know is that it's not a name you should mention around Master Uthar if you can avoid it. That sounds Jurak good. Jurak was once Uthar's master, you see, and the head of this academy. He went a little insane, however, and Uthar forced him to flee to the surface and hide. Ah. It seems that Jorak has been spending his time kidnapping students who wander into the Valley of the Dark Lords. Oh. No idea why. I've also no idea why Uthar doesn't do something about it. If you want prestige, however, you'll find that hermit, as everyone calls him. You'll find Jorak and either kill him or bring back anything he's been writing. Uthar would like that. Now be gone. Okay. I have better things to do than chat with lost hopefuls. I'm not lost. But thanks for the help. Word is that one of our experimental droids went mad and escaped and is hiding in the ruins. I wonder why we don't just... <laughs> oh, dude, you're about to lose. <laughs> How does it need some familiar already? Someone just brought him up, I think. Anything I should be watching for? Shortly before entering the valley, he will pass by a case of not entering the valley. The only other danger to speak of is the two that There are guards that will protect you if you remain in the south part of the valley, however. Uh, okay. You? Achuta. Chamberlain of the Academy. Look after me and supply here. Okay. Um... Huh. Another hopeful wandering about. <laughs> As if I didn't have. Oh uh, yes, I already know about Jorak. Well, the first thing you should know is that it's not a name you should mention around Master Uthar if you can. Jorak yeah, Un was that. once Uthar's master, you see, and it seems that Jorak has been spent. If you want prestige, however, <laughs> now. Okay. Right, so they are noisy with their fighting. <laughs> Sit student. All right, let's go. What's down this way? This is the door. Oh, is this where I came from? Yeah. Okay. And what is over here? Excuse you. I am moving. Is this another card? Is this another dueling room? Interrogation room! Fun! Oh my god, you guys! Okay. Let's heal Karth just in what? case. And we'll save right here. And what time is it? Alright, I got a few more minutes. Kidnap students. Where'd he go? If you're here to use the duel, go ahead. I'm here. Oh, no. Okay. Let's Just go to the computer console and open up one of the cages. And don't be wasted. We only get so many characters a month, you know? Oh, I see. Can I challenge him, dude? No, thanks. I'm pretty sure that now. Oh, alright. Okay, thanks. No problem. Enjoy. Okay, I think... Let's check out this room. Sit and dare me 
Maybe you can do better. Turkey. This Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. Ooh. So far, all the serum combinations I'm using are proving ineffective. If I bring his drug threshold too high, he'll go into shock and be useless. Too low, and he just refuses to talk. It's been maddening. Just activate the console. It gives you a variety of options for serum dosage. The right amount applied at the right rate should do it. The real trick is that the only way to gauge your progress is to watch the prisoner closely for his reaction. Our scanners can't pick up his vitals. Oh boy, you want me to Certainly. try? Uh, just don't kill him or send him into shock. He's supposed to be questioned, not executed. If you manage to get the location of his cash out of him, I'll be sure to pass on the good word to Master Hufa. Okay. Let's save. And we'll then give this a shot. We eat a non dieta. What are you, ma? Use whatever what method you wish, Sid. Uh, Do not break my will. My mind is my own, and I will tell you nothing. Palabule donkey. to tell me where your cash is. Let's just try that. Dang it, it didn't work. <laughs> Gotta try it. All right, uh, activate the serum console. Let's try this. How do you wish to use this? Mm. Truth serum and anti-serum. Let's do a moderate dosage of the truth and see what happens. <laughs> Tell me where your weapon cache is. Puna! Um, what if I did a small dosage? He's getting there, so what if I do another small one? Tell me again! He's breaking though, so at least that's what it seems like. So let's do one more small. Oh my god! Let's do another small. <gasps> Tell me! In the ship! In a trapdoor hidden on the ship. Yes, I heard that. I did it! And I got dark side points. Go figure! Naturally, I would see a reward in. But I would prefer that everyone believe that I extracted the information. What? I'm not letting oh, you get away with this. I suppose one would need to be alive to go running to Master Yutha to report the location of the cat. Oh, you want to fight? Does that mean that you're ready to battle a true Sith then? Shall we make an issue of it? Yeah, 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 let's go. Uh, gather your anger then. Where is he? Oh. Sith interrogator. Let's wound you. And then... Uh... Yeah. Did it work? Oh, it did work. Oh, you did! You just wound yourself! Oh, that's... Okay. Can they not fight? Why aren't you fighting them? Um... Let's try another wound. Do more of that. There we go. Yay! Okay. 
what you got. Oh, heck yeah. All right. I can at least tell Uther about that. I have a feeling I'm supposed to duel somebody, so let's just do that really quick. And then, yeah, and then we will call it for tonight. Verify my identity. Ooh, how many specs do I have? Okay, if I slice this, what can I do? Security cameras. Why are you doing the data files? Reprogram. Oh, I don't have 30 spikes. Attempt to open all cages and free the prisoners. 50 spikes! Let's go into the data files. Why not? Did it work? No files of interest found. Oh, that's kind of a waste of spikes then. Alright, log out. Oh no, wait, I wanna. Items lost, yes, thank you. Let's do somebody just for the funsies of it, I guess. Uh. Prisoner will be injected and armed. Okay. Academy frowns on kills. Have a nice day. Oh. <laughs> I'll kill you. Um Run, I freed you. Wait, I'm not a Sith. This should be fun. Oh, I'm going to get uh I mean, yeah, technically I'm not a Sith yet. Let's see what happens. I'll kill you before you kill me. I swear it. All right. Well, I tried. Oh, because he's a Republic soldier! <laughs> let's wound you. And let's do that and see. Oh, I probably should carry myself. Oh, he's saved. Dang it. Oh, how do you like that? You'll never get me. He's dead. Alright. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna- I'm gonna catch up with Uthar about the, uh, interrogation room at least, and then I'll stop here, and it looks like, uh, the next stream we'll start with all of these, like, side quests I basically got. Holy crap, I have a lot of quests. Yeah. So yeah, we'll- we'll start with that next stream, so let's Greetings, talk to her. Greetings, young one. I have found you to be most impressive. You are off to an excellent beginning. Um, I know the location of the Mandalorian prisoner's weapon cache. You do? That is most interesting. Where might that be? Hidden within a trapdoor on the ship. Hmm. How ironic that I recently had his vessel scrapped for parts then. I had assumed it had been thoroughly scanned. Apparently not. Still, you have done well in bringing me information that others could not unearth on their own. I am impressed. Go now. You have done well. But you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. All right. Very well. You have impressed me. Definitely a good start. Getting there. Okay. Cool. All right. So that's where I'm gonna end tonight. Like I said, we'll get started with all of the other um, all of the other quests uh, starting next week. I will probably start with um. I'll probably go back to the Ebonhawk, actually, starting next week to see about that, uh, the, uh, spice supply. <laughs> Just to get those done before I head off into the valley. And, um, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens from there. But, so, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. It's a lot of fun playing this game, and, um, it's definitely a lot of fun causing some shenanigans, too, on this. And, yeah, hope you're enjoying it. Uh, I hope you guys have had a good Friday so far, and um, also hope that you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend. Uh, our good friend Matt, who is part of Adventure Chicks, should be streaming, I believe, um, now. I believe he started at 7 o'clock, so we are probably going to raid him to kind of keep the weekend going with all of our streams that are within the group. And um, Adventure Check themselves, or as this channel, I should say, uh, will be back tomorrow also in the mornings with Matt speaking of him as he will be streaming his uh, DM prep for his Dungeons and Dragons uh, campaigns or campaign that he does on 
Mondays with a group, personal group. And so um, after that, we will be back with our Adventures in Middle Earth campaign on Tuesday. And yeah, there's the schedule posted on chat. So that's what's coming up next. Again, don't forget about the Dice uh, Goblin stickers if you've been interested and in that we have two left. I don't think anything has changed since then. And uh, oh, thanks for the, the subscription, PJ Chaos. I really appreciate it. And uh, am I missing anything? No, I think that's it. Past that, if you like what we do and you want to chat with us and hang out, we do have a Discord channel full of crazy uh, shenanigans between uh, miniature painting and other um, art hobbies and whatnot on there. We have a channel for pets where we just post our uh, cute photos of pets called Pence Adventurers. Um, we have a channel for if you're looking for a Dungeons and Dragons group um, you can look up and set up groups through that way and a ton of other different things so uh, yeah if you feel like hanging out with us check out there but past that I think we're all good to uh, raid Matt at this time I don't see let's go find him what is he doing here Let's see if I can read them. How do I do this? <laughs> Unless, oh, okay, there we go. So we're, he's gonna be on in 10 seconds, but thanks guys, really appreciate it. Happy Friday, see you later.